Okay, welcome to session 13 Nigga. of uh, You Bastard. <laughs> you uh, to Jericho. Uh, I think Adam, uh, I mean back. Vulcan, can kick it off then uh, on that roll. Yeah, I think, I think, I think, oh. <laughs> Last time on Craig to Jericho. Uh, I can't remember what we did. Oh, Chihat tried to defeat his enemy. Oh, we didn't do, we didn't do a right lot. We killed the Necromancer and then we, um, then Kieran tied up the Atten for some reason. I wasn't going to beat it, it on my own. Well, you, you could have stabbed it in the face after you tied it up. You really, uh... I don't know. You really you cheated to yourself. Experiment with it. See, the thing was, if you'd taken that etting out while we weren't there, you could have hoarded... You could have got all the XP to just you, because we wouldn't have no, counted Tom, as Tom the shared, Tom shared it all, though, didn't you, Tom? Yeah. It's not dead. So it doesn't matter. It's you don't get XP just by killing it, you also get the XP by defeating the encounter and tying it up and making it, you know, unable to do shit. Should be enough yeah, to say that he beat the encounter. So. Mm -hmm. Basically, I'm a winner. And apparently also, we're not, also, because also. our guy... Well, actually, he didn't get away, did he? We killed him. Um, <laughs> took us longer than we planned, it, though. Yeah. We just basically just killed fish that Just walked into a necromancer's house. Killed his helpers, massacred his, uh... Yeah! <laughs> God, why is this, why why is this nasty like beast? Are we level 6 now? Sorry. Depends what... what are you level 6? <laughs> I just barely got level 6, so you might not be, or you might be. Yeah, I'm... Um, I'm is, the ne is the next experience 23,000? Yeah. That's for yeah. level 7. Level yeah, 6 so I'm, was so, 14,000. So no, so I'm level 6, yeah, it's fine. Was it 14? Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, it was it. Alright, so... You guys are making your way back to the camp. <clears throat> and you uh, you all trot on in. On which see an Etin tied to the floor. I'm gonna, uh, like, probably... As seeing it, I'm gonna be like, what the hell is that thing doing alive? And then... <laughs> do, I, do I smell it being undead? Yeah, I'd, I'd go over and probably... <laughs> Well, I need to ask that question. We we smashed it to bits the other day. <laughs> yeah. Yes, you did. As I see them like come over, I sort of like saunter over, like, ah, hello, friends. Welcome back. Yeah, I, jo I join you. I'm behind you. Actually, no, I'm watching the Etin. Sorry. This entire thing smell of petrol. Yeah, yeah. I imagine it'll reek of, of oil. Yeah, it'll smell of oil definitely. I opened oh, up an Etin and tied it down. Well, you're welcome. Get in incinerated then. Shouldn't leave it there. Could break out. I, I, I just did what was best at the time. You're welcome I'm, to kill the beast I'm, should I'm you wish. I'm literally just already putting my sword through its head. I'm gonna put yeah. one of the new swords through its head. I'm jabbing it with a lance. Dude, they're distance. like too expensive to do that. <laughs> That's true, they meant Seriously. <laughs> okay, yeah, I just, send, I just send a regular sword through its head. In fact, no, I'm gonna go above it, like, executioner style. And it's then just fire it down, it down into its head. So what you're saying is, he's doing a leg list from the first film. <laughs> yes. He's got two heads as well. So yeah, he's yeah, got something. two heads, <laughs> you can do that twice. Haha, <laughs> 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 and it's like... Oh, sick. <laughs> You've quite a yeah, dumb okay. guy, you always pissed me off. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say you kill him. Yeah, he's not... Uh, breaking out of that. Uh, breaking out of that. Really shit. That was disgusting. I was so don't care. You can't say anything. I can. Watch me. That was disgusting. <laughs> uh, so he's dead. Um, he dead or he no. When, he, when you, he, they see you going back. Uh, so burpy. Um, the uh, merchants all like, exit their... Um, the little carriage and go over to you. Oh, oh, oh hello, sir. It was. Oh, thank God you're back. It was. It was frightful. And sort of like gesture. I want to like shoot him a glare as in. What do you mean frightful? I say. <laughs> How's? Have they been in there just waiting for us to come back? Because like, like that guy tied netting down. We're not even. <laughs> I don't even know whether we want to talk to him. They just stayed in the wagon. Basically, yeah. Wow. <laughs> like I saved their that's lives. That's fucking or shit, right there, Kieran. I know. I might be triggered. <laughs> Are you though? 
I suppose we'll just reassure them that we know what we're doing. We are, after all, professionals. Experts, <laughs> professionals at something. Na, na, na. I don't know giant slayers. Mm -hmm. Maybe not giant slayers, but. So, yeah, the guy's going to say, um, Is all your business in this swamp concluded? I believe so. Does anyone else have anything you want to do? You could walk around the hills a bit more. Or... <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm good. Then to the palm, then. Onward to glory. Right. Mount up, and I'll do the and whole. May you know, the odds <laughs> ever be in your favour. <laughs> Come on, boy, mount up. Negro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna put. What do your elf eyes? Gonna have to change that at a later date. But there you go. I'm just gonna put an E on the map there for Etin. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'll add something in later. Yeah, you 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 do that later. <laughs> All right. So. Oh. Let's see, it's like eating a really dry pie, so my throat's like. Bleh. Okay, so you're gonna set off towards the palm again uh, with. Less than half of the of the of the men you came out with, um, but we've got the important ones. Yep, you do. Kind of. Um, See, we're not like I didn't more say more Like they're gonna get a a taste for us as successful caravan guards, where their shitty guards failed. We 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 prevailed. <laughs> I mean, certainly. Which think, so, boys, you know, this main quest, I would just do this twenty. Do this for uh, the entire of the game. Just, yeah, yeah, sounds good. Just main campaign off. But, yeah, I'm fine. Uh, don't, like, don't forget uh, that we have kind of, you know, we need more money than we are getting right now. Basically, yeah. Nah, I'm loaded. I'm a baron. In fact, I don't, I don't know how much all that stuff was worth we got from the necromancer's house. Probably not much. Hmm. Hmm? Oh, yeah. By the way, I have absolutely no idea what you were doing while you were gone. Oh, yeah. What well, sucks sure. to be you, right? You ask? Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I mean, that if you'd be willing to inform me of your of your thrilling adventures, I'm more than happy to listen. I'll, I'll be, like, sat on the wagon, and I'll just be like, well. And then I, I just, we'll just, I'll, like, pull you up onto the wagon alongside me, and we'll, and as we ride, I'll tell you everything, basically. But like, I really like that little flag that you put on the brick. <laughs> that looks <you> wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't a flag until we won it. Then, then I put the flag on. Alright, that makes sense. So, you go trotting on. Um, you meet you or let's see, I'll move you down. No. No. So, you move on and um, full day of traveling. Night, <clears throat> night draws near. Um, and you'll, you'll set up camp again. The place is similar to last time, only um, it's, there's slightly more solid ground here. It's uh, less less waterlogged. Um, the forests are thicker here, whereas in the bog, uh, all the trees were kind of just gnarled and without uh, leaf leaves and stuff. Um, here, it's a lot more. It's looking like it's looking like an actual place again. Um, for now. For now. So you're supposed to all set up camp. Is there anything you guys want to do in the night? I'm cool to now. Stay guard. <laughs> yeah, I'll. I don't. I don't mind taking first shift. I've had a very hard day killing Ettins. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to sit this. I'll do second, and I'm pretty sure we're done then. Okay. Next day. Oh, refilling them spell slots. Don't try and get that one past me, yep. Jimmy. Everyone refill thy spell slots and heal thyselves and get hit die and stuff, yeah. Yeah. Anyone who's leveled up, don't forget to have added your health and shit. Oh, yeah, shit. Sure. I'm literally doing that now. I'm so unprepared. Luke's just frantically adding. Uh, <laughs> but bye, speak with animals. Oh, I want to, um, before we carry on, I want to approach mm. Larfian about the feather we gained. Okay. Oh, yeah. Sure thing. Cause like we sort, you, you sort of got it, and then we just sort of glazed over it, didn't we? Yeah, cause 
I think at the time it was more just like we need to get out of this place, yeah. so let's just put it put it aside and go. I'll yeah, I'll just say. So have you tried it then? Like when we just like round the campfire, like like it's been on my mind, but you might not even have thought about it. I'll just yeah, say I'll, I'm probably very much like tried what the feather, of course. I how I don't know how to use it. I you've even not even it. you've not even began a tuning. I don't know how to do that. <laughs> or would I, would I know how to do that, Tom? Like, we, we all technically know how to do it, but like, I'd be like, like this, like this, like, and I'll just sort of like sit you down, like, while we're by the fire, and I'll be like, no, focus on it. Really focus on it. <laughs> I guess I'm probably just like a bit skeptical and just like looking at it, just like <laughs> looking around with my eyes, like, hmm. <laughs> But perhaps. Now yeah. close your eyes and try and picture the object. Okay. Lorathian Lur pictures. Some... What apparently, you... apparently Pitch Adam the is feather? the other. Is it picture the <laughs> feather you must? As <laughs> it closes his eyes, I sharply punch him in the face just for the lot. <laughs> <laughs> <Okay. laughs> no. Um, while you like this, I'll be like. Let's just get me in the ball. Now try and feel out its aura. And I'll just, I'll just keep we'll keep going on like this basically. It's like 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 one of those relaxing uh, meditation things where someone speaks to you whilst you. <laughs> I don't okay. quite Do know it. how it how it how Do I like. Start to... Yeah. I don't know how it works in your world, Tom. So like, I was how did, to you ask yeah. Me. I've just been trying to Tom. make stuff up here. <laughs> what what would I, what would my character be? What would the sensation be for my character then, in your in your magic system? In my magic system. Uh, well, well, your world, how would, it, how would it be? I think for different types of magic users, it would be a different sort of sensation. Um, for, uh, as well as for different people's expectations of things as well. Like, um, for example, I would assume when a, when a wizard who's seen combat like, um, like Vulcan, it would very much be like asserting his uh asserting his his ownership over it just like for, like forcefully because it's his and he what you know it's his to use it's his tool uh mm. well for you perhaps uh, you know it being like a very beautiful uh feather of a of a woodland creature it'd be very much almost like asking to use it maybe Right, so not like demanding it from the yeah. object, but okay. So yeah, I guess I guess perhaps I, re I reach a certain open point yourself. Of, yeah, a, a certain point of serenity, of quote close quote, and uh, then perhaps like I'm starting to visualize this this um, hippogriff, perhaps, mm -hmm. and I'm I'm more like starting to try and ha like do you know when you're in a dream and you know you know you know about the character that you're thinking about yeah. and you kind of you kind of influence that character without specifically saying anything perhaps that's what's going on and i'm more just like um starting up a conversation about like oh so you must be the owner of this feather and uh what who, who is who is it uh, who who are you where are you from like like trying to find out more about this hippogriff. I know you said it was thick, though, so maybe it doesn't understand a word I'm saying. But it's not <laughs> like a, it, it, but it's not. Dumb, kid. But it's not like a. It's not like a, a a conversation. It's more just like I already know it, but I'm asking it anyway, type thing. And then mm -hmm. maybe towards the end, I'm just like, I'm I'm trying to see if I can almost ask for its acceptance of me. Maybe not. Maybe not like <laughs> ask for its like its ability to to summon it. I don't know. Is that what it is? Yes. Yeah, okay. Ends up so, going, no. Yeah, but like, <laughs> I'm, I'm, asking, I'm asking for its acceptance oh, yeah. of me to, 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 to own it, but not mm -hmm. to that kind of thing. Yeah. Do, do, do I get a, a, a positive response after attuning with it for a short rest? I think you get, for this situation, you probably just get a squawk. Fucking dog bird. 
No, it doesn't. No, because it doesn't respond. It's like, like I say in the dream, it's like a, <laughs> it just is there, and I know what it's saying, but I don't have to speak to it to it's get. It's trying it, to respond. This is so just, trippy. Really fun yeah, it's now. one of those weird dream <laughs> states. That's what I'm trying to visualize. No, right I just now. mean it's so dumb. It it can't. It doesn't even know how to, to be, to speak. It doesn't even know what it's doing. It doesn't. I, I, I'm telling you now, if it's something <laughs> used and and it's in got some sort of magic around it. It will be slightly heightened above a regular hippogriff. <laughs> so it's dumb, nigga. So it's not, it's not, it's not a too intelligence, <laughs> sort of too intelligence bird. Uh, <laughs> it's funny um, because it, it basically is. <laughs> I've, I've, We've got like an intelligence of something like that. I was you like, get, you get, you get the feeling that um, it's weighing you up. Uh, it might may take a little bit longer. Okay. Cue the scene from Harry Potter. Go on. Well, <laughs> <laughs> it's like, now ride him. And it's like, he's so, he's so angry at him. He's so angry. Oh, my God. He's going to kill you. Just ride him quickly. <laughs> Quick. <laughs> hand in his mouth, Harry. He's like, what? <laughs> your hand in his mouth. Quickly, okay, grab him by let the him just, Let him just nibble your fingers. Pull, pull that sensitive feather on his forehead, Harry. <laughs> 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 the eyes had run. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yeah, that's what you get. Good. So another another time then. And I let I guess I let I guess I let the vision fade, and then uh, I'll I'll say to I'll I'll say to Vulcan I think I think I got through to it, but I don't know if I can quite uh, connect with it yet. I don't know what it is though. Try. I am doing, but perhaps another time. There is no try, only do. <laughs> <laughs> nice try. Put your head in this mouth, Harry. Fuck's <laughs> oh, damn it, guys. Oh, well, I, mm, okay then. We'll keep trying. Every time. God, mm -hmm. didn't know I was teaching the remedial class, God. Fuck out. Just summon the damn hippogriff, you pussy. Wow. Alright, <clears throat> so. Uh, so. Alright, I've got uh, I've got a price list for all your stuff now. I'll tell you that later. Um. Anyway. So we're gonna we're gonna continue. We're moving. Uh, God, I hope I still have it now. I have, I have, I have the table face. I'm hoping I Guys, still Jimmy's have it. Lost it. I lost nothing. He's lost uh, his mojo. I lost my mojo. Mojo, no. I'm not gonna lie, I'm looking at on my bookmarks and I see Sad Torbjorn and I'm just like can't, I don't I can't click it. Get your IMO. What, what why 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 Torbjorn though? What has he done to you? Kieran <laughs> send him Sad Torbjorn. Okay. Do 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 Get you out of oh my god. Yeah. So, another day of travelling. Where uh, nothing happens. Shit. Close. Roll to me. Look at me, a professional. Oh, damn. I'm coming back. Send Skype while if you're interested. <laughs> what were the cat things called we thought? Cat things? Um, this place would be. This is place that you beat you. This is it. I thought. Hi. What is happening? I, I don't really know. I think the Germans. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, okay, so I met Japanese so... students yesterday and learned a few new words. Of course you did. Of course you did. Nice. Hi. Okay, 
So, <laughs> everyone paying attention. So, as we're, we're, you're riding along, um, you can see you can see deep over the distance now. It's a, it's a, it's just a town. It's not massive. Um, for you know, for, for for a not a town, sorry. It's like a like a village. Um, it's not anywhere near big enough to be considered like a town. Um, but it's it's, it's fairly sizable. Um, a lot of the areas around it um, is covered in uh, farmland, and you you could see beyond that. Um, there's there's like there's a, a heat haze here. It's quite hot here actually. Um, on the left of you, you see um, what looks like a, a mountain range covered with uh, covered with ice. Um, but also, that has a very intense heat haze over it. Um, and there's like steam and smoke and stuff rising from the mountains themselves. It, it's quite a, quite a striking sight, really. Um, but it's still you're still in the plains. But um, you're seeing the ground. Some of the ground uh, is sort of mixed with sand every now and then. Uh, you're definitely well, nice. getting. You're definitely getting closer now um, to the de- to to full on desert, um, but you're not quite there yet. <clears throat> are we still finding like roughage for the the horses and stuff? And you water? are, uh, but it's it's getting very scarce now. It's like you occasionally you get like a very ragged, uh, long like like um, that, that is able to survive this sort of really hot climate. That's the merchants sure. like packing water barrels and stuff. Yes, yeah, they are. Oh, good. They're all sorted. They, they, they haven't even, um, other, other than you know, <clears throat> join you around the fire for meals and stuff. They pretty much just stay in their carriages. It, you could tell that they definitely are not used to dealing with heat. So they remain, they sort of like remain in their carriages and like with like, like sweating buckets with like fans and stuff. Yeah, my favorite terrain is the desert, so you know I'm. I'm, I'm sure. <laughs> Your favorite terrain was the forest, and now it's the desert. Yeah, but you adapted. Yeah. <laughs> did you get to pick? Did you get to pick another one or something? At level six, yeah. So. <laughs> oh. Desert it is. <laughs> you're a you're a real bitch, you know that. Uh, Consi- yeah, but considering perhaps maybe I visited the grave of all those children, you know, in the desert, <laughs> you know, maybe maybe I had previous knowledge of the desert. <laughs> I like. <laughs> I like how when it suits you, <laughs> you'll accept for the children massacre. <laughs> <laughs> the rest of the time, you're like, whoa, I didn't even kill any kids, I'm a fucking messenger. <laughs> then I don't like, even know what a kid is. I was like, of course of I know how to navigate the desert. I buried the children. <laughs> <laughs> <In my own>. <laughs> <laughs> I scouted the area. <laughs> <laughs> I buried the last though. message. I buried the area. I mean, what? <laughs> Alright, so you march up towards deep, deep home. You've got quite an average pace on. Uh, but from where you are, who's uh, so it's in three carriages. Who sat in the front carriage? Probably me. Uh, I'm in the front carriage. Down. I'll be in the middle or near the back. What? I'm on my mount. Uh, yeah, you're on your mount, um, with you with your little waggy wag. So what does what does what does your uh, uh, what does your what does your mount look like to everyone else? Has everyone else seen your wag? You have a... no, it's it's not here yet. We haven't, you know, summoned it. Where's um, uh, where's Vulcan? Vulcan introduced? Yeah. <clears throat> well, when you when you want to do that, let me know. <laughs> yeah, we we need time for that though. Yep. Where's Vulcan? Okay, so... Where is Vulcan? Oh, People back. Be chi- I'll be I'll be like lazing in the sun on the you know, like the. F- Next to what's the what's the carriage guy called? Uh, oh, my good Av- friend Avtor. Avtor, Avtor, yeah. Yeah. Avtor, yeah. so, even Avtor, it occurs to all of you you've never seen Avtor without a pipe in his mouth. <laughs> Ever. Like, like he sleeps with that pipe in his mouth. There's something weird going on with that man. <laughs> you're, so, if you're, if you're a carriage driver. There's got to be something wrong with you. Yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> it's, just, it's just part of the business. 
Yeah. So I'm actually uh, on the carriage that Vulcan's on, and if he's trying to relax and have peace, I can imagine I'm just annoying the living <coughs> shit out so of him on, sometimes. You're on your carriage. Maybe. Yeah, I'm trying to be like quiet and stuff. So I'm carriage up the front, or is it bringing up the rear? I'm in middle, so it'd be with me probably. Yeah. I'm just trying to ask him about magic and stuff. And, so, Larathian. Uh, I'll, I'll be on the front, yeah. Do you want me a perception? Yeah. Of oh, some purple worms! <laughs> JK. That would be silk. Birds in the sky. Yeah. No purple worms. This Can my bird give them assistance if it's constantly searching? Because it's uh, it technically can't. working on the same clock. They're it working can't. on the same task. Doesn't need it. Doesn't need to. Doesn't need to. <laughs> Mm. Look at Dom and his little grin on his face. He's so happy with himself. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you, you're looking out uh, out across the uh, across the expanse. Well, hey, and um, can't wait for that. Where's James? Yep. And you uh, you notice know, something very very strange um, ahead. Because so you still like half a day's ride from the uh, from the village, but. All dotted around the area, just all over the place. Like the, the part that you're passing now is uh, farmland, but you know it's and, and Vulcan. I think you definitely know this. Definitely perks you and uh, and probably Lazarus as well. Actually, uh, as you're riding along, all of this, all of the um, the farmland that's quite far away from the village, uh, it doesn't look healthy. Uh, it looks. Uh, it looks abandoned. Uh, Withering. Or whatever. Yeah. Uh, Lazar, can you roll me a religion, please? Religion? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like I excited you are for that. It's like, finally. <laughs> finally, it can suck because I don't have any intelligence or wisdom. But yeah, sure. That's well, good enough. That was okay. Good. Is bit, if you had a disadvantage, well, hey, <laughs> Easy then. <laughs> so, after looking, so, after a while, if you like, just like looking to and from the other side of the carriage, uh, and also like, not closely inspecting, um, but definitely getting a good, a good eye of these, um, what, what's, what looks, it looks like these crops, the, the, the crops and the, the plots of land themselves are actually blighted. Um, there are records of this dating back from when Oleron first rose, uh, being that one, one of the one of the big things that his quote unquote ascension uh, did was bring a fairly fairly hefty plague to a lot of the workable farmland um, that eventually, through efforts after after he was defeated, through efforts of uh, not so the grey cloaks, but definitely the serfs under them, and a lot of the surviving townspeople that were still loyal to Sif uh, were able to cleanse a lot of the land and bring back the, the Morazon's like arable uh, power. Um, but it it looks very akin to that. The, the ground here does not look healthy. It looks it looks, but it, it doesn't look just dead. It looks like magically so. Ooh, you well, piqued my interest, Tom. I will <laughs> first. I will fall back a bit, right next to the cart where Lucan is in, and tell him a cool story I just remembered. Mm. And then I will re relay that story to the rest of the group. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Can I Arcana? Since he's tall, he's in the same place. Sure. Can I can I work out what it is or what what could have caused it or some. I don't know, I'm just spitballing, man. Uh, you can do an account okay. shot. <laughs> While you're doing that, uh, Dom. Fucking hell! Tell me, <laughs> tell me everything about the blades of grass. Tell me what <laughs> impacted what. I want to know atom collisions. I want it all. Uh, basically, a magical hydron collider. Uh, no. <laughs> uh, before that, Dom. Or oh, rather, Lorathia. Um, so, as I was saying before I got sidetracked, um, you see lots of um, spread out along the, along the fields, uh, both both from the left and right of the village. You see lots of solitary figures, mo uh, just just milling about. 
Um, very jankily. Oh, God. They don't look like they're... Uh, and they're, they're quite spread out. Um, but straight ahead down the road, uh, from where you can see the very, the very large gate of Deep Palm, because uh, Deep Palm was primarily a mining town. It had a very large... Um, very large entranceway for uh, like um, carriages that were built for heavy duty mining, mine, you know, like uh, hauling of um, mine materials and such. Yeah. Uh, so it was this very large gateway, and you could see a, a thick, a thick um, gathering of bodies. Okay, I just I tell uh, our coach driver to, sl to like slow and halt the carriage uh, and I'll like just turn and yell Vulcan can you send that bird send your bird to scout ahead there seems to be something in front of deep hole so especially as that happens I'm going to do Vulcan because I think I've asked people to roll too quickly uh, I'll just do Vulcan's roll now so you like you like hop down um, from the carriage and um you like go go and examine some of the shrubs and stuff as as everything stops, um, sort of pick up some of the sort of the dead foliage, so sort of like sift some of the um, some of the uh, the soil through your hand and sort of like probe it a, a little bit with your magic. Um, <laughs> definitely necromancy, very strong. And then my character shouts back and says, "Welcome, to you made ahead." Yeah, is that how that went? Yeah. Uh, one okay. thing you do notice after going through it a little bit as well is um, you will you you especially as being a soldier would I I'll, I'll, I'll reckon that you probably know grain slash corn when you see it because that will have been a lot, a lot of the staple sort of food that you would have eaten as a soldier um, and these are all, these are all cornfields. And they're all laid low by this necromancy. Yes. And your mind flashes back to the plagued corn that the Essens were ingesting. Mm. Okay, then. Mm. All right, then. Yeah, after I've done this, I'll jump back up onto the carriage and just, like, yeah, I'll eyes black over and I'll send the bird on. Okay. Bird is the one. I'm pouring myself some peps. I don't know how close I can get before I like lose contact with it. Uh, well, it's still a good distance away. It's it's the the road straight to Deep Home is a very 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 long road. You're still technically over uh, about half a day away. Oh right. Oh okay. Oh hang on. It's just it's very flat uh, and very straight. So you you just from where you are, you're just able to see things from where you are. Uh, Can we? We have a spyglass, don't we? You do. Yeah. Oh yeah. We do. Did we? Did we actually get one? I can't. Remember. I got one. I think. Yeah. Yeah, we did get one. Um, so your, your bird wouldn't be able to. Wouldn't unfortunately be able to do it because it could do like hundred meters. I think. I could send it there and then get it to come back, but it'd only be like, "What did you see?" You know what I mean? And then it'd be like, <laughs> bird shrugging shoulders. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So shrugs shoulders, squawk. Yeah. Unless it can, like, take pictures with its mind and then just deliver them to me. <laughs> I don't know about that. That's, that's, that's going it to sounds be... a bit too beyond from that, of the bird, yeah. Beyond the bird. <laughs> sounds like a film. <laughs> I, think, I think it can detect threats and that's about it, really, other than... Right. So are you, are you bringing to bear Das, das Spyglass then? Yeah. Das, um... das Boot. Where is it? Yeah, I'll just mention it. I'll come up alongside Larkin. Jump on my horse, but in fact, actually. Mm -hmm. Oh, and everyone who didn't take a lance, add a lance to. Well, like, can we just say that we've added a lance to each of the horses, the players' horses? You, got, you only got three extra lances, just saying. Well, yeah, we do have four horses, and I already have one, yeah. so. So we, we got three. So there's one person without a lance. A lance. It's, Sorry? It's probably. Um, who, who wouldn't want to use a lance off a horse? Uh, me. I don't, I don't think I'd use a lance. Oh, in that case, no, actually, I'm, I'm, no, yeah, I would actually use a lance now. 
Uh, everyone, yeah. everyone, book Kieran. Add a lance. Yeah. Iron lance. Okay. I'll find the base base lance stats. Yeah. And just putting brackets next to it on horse. You know, ride up alongside Domia. I would say it's probably best we keep going, get a bit closer, find out if Deep Home's actually fallen, because it might just it might just have sealed its gates while this plague like just squanders the countryside around it, hoping that it'll pass by. We may be able to just ride around lancing them. It's not like they don't appear to be any faster her, than the things we've fought before, unless there's more intelligent undead that we don't know about among the crowd. It's a possibility, but perhaps if we move ahead of the carts, <coughs> just, just scout it. Hmm. I'm, I'm fine with that, as long as we... As long as we um, don't go too far, I don't want to allow another Etin to creep up on yeah. the Baron. Yeah. I'll just tie it down, it's fine. We could, I say we could, we could go on for another, like, half a day. We could go on for, like, another two-thirds of a day, you know what I mean? Get yeah. within, like, under a mile of it, and then just, yeah, then do it. Can we do that, Chip? Yeah. Because I bet these things can't see shit. Like, I know we can see far because of the planes, but I don't, I, if they're undead, I don't know how far they can see. Imagine they're dumb as fuck. <laughs> well, I imagine, yeah. <laughs> Never know. Yeah, so we'll keep doing that. Everyone's good with that. Cool me. <laughs> Super cool, bruh. So you ride on, um, and you stop at the, 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 you know, mile away. Oh, the distance, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'll tell the merchants that, uh, do you want, do you actually want to come, Kieran, or are you going to hold the fort again? I'm going to come so this time. He's going. <laughs> I I stayed on my He's own. going. What a boy. It's actually a flat land. We're in a flat land, aren't we? So we can perceive threats around us. Like, yeah. is there anything for miles? No. Other than deep it, it looks like It looks like the bodies at the gate are slowly losing interest and they are wandering out. As I said, there are a lot, there are, are still quite a few just around, moving away from the uh, away from the place and towards you. But they're, they're moving very, oh. very slowly and they're very, very spread out. They're coming from one direction. So, like, it's, mm -hmm. we've got relative safety then leaving the merchants. Whoa, whoa, like whoa, a... whoa. Really? You sure? Like, anything could come out of those fields. Well, like, they're they're flat. Like, all the corn's, like, flat. Yeah, can... and it doesn't mean that undead can't be lying down on the corn or... Stealthy zombies. Be... In fact, I just, at this point, when Lucan's like... <laughs> but... It could be anywhere. I just rest my animal. Tell you trying to sell them. I say, hey, thank you for volunteering to stay behind, Lucan. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe if you're a pussy, you stay behind, Lucan. Can we not just bring the merchants with us, or just have them? I don't know, trailing behind us. How high are these carriages, like Tomo? Like, are they like? Is it like shoulder height? The like the rim of the carriage? Uh, like, no, that's it's much taller. They're much taller than that. Oh, they're taller. Okay, so yeah. we, the horses would be the only thing under threat, would be if, if like yeah. zombies were like claws. Okay. Oh, we're gonna have a lot of enemies. <laughs> Just copying the zombies. Yeah. yeah. Individual, individuals are the crowds or groups. Bandit. Individuals or small groups. Because the thing is, we can like. We can just do drive-bys on them with lances, can't we? <laughs> drive-bys? Well, we can't catch I... us because they're, they're fucking undead. And we're on riding horses, aren't we? Holy... All you have to do is fucking ding! Fucking ping it in the head with your lance and carry on past. You know what I mean? We could just... We just it would get an attack of opportunity, though. Oh, not if we're not within... No, no won't go, because the yeah. lance is ten feet long. Yeah. So you just... Nice. Ping it on the head and pass by. Yeah. We 
could you use minor illusion to make a really loud sound to distract them all along the way and then sneak past? I could sneak past them anyway. Actually, I think I Yeah, could... well, not all of us can sneak past them, Luke. I could get two of us to sneak past them. Whoa. It's With a big what? lollipop. Oh my god. <laughs> He's got What's a high-vis he... jacket. <laughs> the app's <laughs> The app's talk. talking. Oh. Right then. What, what do you think, guys? What's our goal here? To get in or beat as many zombies as we can? Let's get in. Get in, but, but like, they're probably just gonna be like, there's zombies outside, and then we'll be like, yeah, I suppose we should deal with those. Or, or do we not want to do it? I thought this was like the mission. Isn't it? Aren't what you if gay you sent some people in? Lazarus? Aren't you gay for the undead, Lazarus? <laughs> Fucking Balkan 2016. Oh, 17. Ah, no! I've already done it. Yeah, I'll be like, Lazarus, like, are you interested in, like, <laughs> clearing these, or...? I'm I'm interested in purging them, yes. <laughs> so, <laughs> yep. Absolutely. I'm completely fine with this, yeah, like... Like, because we can, we can purge them with relative safety. My blade hungers for undead's blood. Actually, they don't have blood. Wow. Right round lance in them, yeah. We're like... I call. They'd have a little We've bit of rock like, blood. Yeah. Like, Lars is like a... You're, you're like mounted cavalry as fuck, aren't you? Like, I can... Well, I'm, I'm the I king can, of mounted uh, mounted combat, yes, indeed. I can use a lance. Can you use all martial weapons, Dom? Uh, yes. You don't even have to waste arrows, I'm like... And Kieran, can you use... I, I don't think Kieran... <laughs> I can't use a lance, but I might be able to fire an arrow off of a horse, Chippy. Can I do that, or is that a thing that I have to I'd say you could know do that, how yeah. to do? You, it's just you'll, it's just you might lose arrows. That's all I was thinking. Like that's cool. I've got like seven. <laughs> yeah, can we? <laughs> and, can, and you can, Luke, can't you? Because you're like a, you're bored now, aren't you? Yeah, like I, I get the the lance and like shook it from one hand to the other and be like, yeah, I've been watching you guys. I think I can do this now. <laughs> Just like looking down the, the end of the lance. <laughs> it's like <laughs> tiny boy with this huge lance. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Kieran. A anyone who yeah. isn't trained and, and has to use arrows probably would need to steady their horse before, before like, like sort of stop before firing it briefly yeah. because... You're not trained in horse combat. I'll, I'll, I'll be the cover fire from the back. <laughs> cover for you. Wee, you are hot. Why did everyone wow. really kill Kieran from that? I'll thing? tell you what you could do. You could just, you could ride wow. ahead of us just at full pelt. And then like, just get everything to just like, focus I can on be you the as distraction we ride from the back. Yeah, basically. <laughs> And then stealth I, I can be a distraction because I can use minor illusion to make like a big noise from where I am and, and get all the attention on me, and you can like, like, pick them off. The thing is, like we can't we can't really do much to, to them when they're grouped up. The fact that they're all spread out lets us just you know, like pick them all off okay. one by one. So I don't know whether um, that'd be that. Yeah. No, do we have do we have anything to spread them out? Now? Hmm? Do we have anything that can spread them out? I'm I'm not talking to you, GM. I'm talking to my party. Wait, wait, wait sorry. So how how long how much daylight have we got left? I really don't want to be outside. The uh, whilst uh, the zombies. Yeah, this is, this I'm is gonna I'm say I'm not a lot. It's getting dark. It's it's still light, but not for long. It, it, within an hour, an hour or so, it's good. It's gonna be pretty dark. We're gonna need like, to like lead. We can't kill all of them. We're gonna have to like lead them away from the main road so the main. Yeah. I, I prefer not to leave them away to so just piss to just purge the ones in front of the entrance and then the rest will just keep bobbling against a wall we can't get past and then yeah and we can take them out from above hmm. yeah we can either we can either wait till tomorrow and take them out then hmm. or we can get someone to walk around the outside of the wall just like trailing something that will just keep their attention and then okay. it's if we're inside not them... we can get more people yeah it's just uh, better to not let them as if there's anyone well. alive inside the people, sure the, 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 say, peop could, the people Vulcan. from Deepholm might be yeah. outside as the undead. Uh, could Vulcan <laughs> make me? Oh shit! Uh, 
Oh, an insight. Oh, okay. <clears throat> About to say he's got the spyglass. Him, him. <laughs> but if it's just inside, not an investigation, Tom. No. <laughs> no. Hey, you're all pretty well today. Um. I L M A O. No. Yeah. What 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 you were talking about outside of meta is definitely. Something that you cursed you in meta. Like if you happen to find your, if you get into there, you've just walked into a bigger kill box with nowhere to retreat. Sorry, a smaller kill box. A more kill it. I was about to say, like, is com is are the front gates open? Is that thing. what the? Are you joking? <laughs> No, because no. if they're open, then they're they're, they're well, definitely out can there. Can we see they're people on the then. walls? Because we're like within a mile now. Can we use it? Can Lara's in it? You can't see anyone on the walls currently. Because well, laughing has got the sniper scope, hasn't he? Sniper skilly. Listen, right from where we are, how long would it take to to travel on foot there? On foot? Mhm. Mm or on horses? On foot. You're about a mile away, so about 20 minutes. 20 minutes. All right. If okay. Uh, yeah, I'll pull, Vul I'll pull Vulcan to the side. Uh, and I'm like, listen, I've I've learned a new spell. I wanted to wait before showing you, I don't know, maybe something impressive or something. But I'm pretty sure I can turn me and I think one more person invisible. For I can hold it about uh, an hour before I get tired and it it runs out. But yeah, so maybe we could get there to check whether there's anyone in there in the first place, and then get back in time. It will be cutting it close. I mean, might be with having to. How would through. we get over the walls? Uh, we'd have to see when we're there. If we can't find any way, then I guess we just have to go back and and it is what it is. Like, but you'd still we might have, get... you'd have like what a, a good twenty minute uh, grace period. Yeah, you've got a, yeah, we've can... got a good buffer zone. With mm, that. Yeah. Uh, Did we find out if the doors open or not? No, it's closed. Doors are shut. That's why. That's why. That's why there's a big bunch. Of oh, them actually, again. does it let? I me... didn't know what that was. I thought it was boulders. <laughs> Boulders. Boulders gate. Ha! Well, to be fair, literally oh. everything on this map is green except from the big yeah. purple square. No, I was gonna well, say. the fact that that. Oh, look, right. Shut up, you. Stop trying to, to be fair, the things. two red lines look like open doors. Oh, no, that's just that's just the gate brace. That's that's the width of the gate. The gate brace. Braces. Okay. The gate. Yeah. What do you think? In fact, actually. Um, let me just check the spots. No. Uh, well, what, like, it, should it be me and you doing this? Like, we have, we've got, what about Dom? If, if it's, if it's you and someone else, I'm not particularly stealthy on. Like, um, it I depends what you think. I'm just thinking, even if we can't get up into the, in, by the gate, you could send your bird to have a look over it at least. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah, I didn't think of that. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I can use the yeah, self to make myself look like a zombie and come with. Once we're, yeah, once we're in range. You could actually... <laughs> yeah, you'd, have, you'd probably have to kill one of them to accurately... Why? Give, to I just wear what, what he's saying. Oh, yeah. I, I changed my clothes and everything. I yeah, I know. Sure. But you probably have to see one to see what, the condition, what sort of condition the zombies are in. In order to disguise yourself accurately. If you walk in there, like, if you walk in there like a fresh ass zombie, and this, then, you know. <laughs> fresh <laughs> Prince of Bel Air. Fresh, fresh Quick Prince question: Did did we um did the did the men the fell to the Etin uh, to the Etin and its cats? Did we bring them along? Did the merchants deem it worthy to like save their bodies for their families? Uh, Kieran could just start wearing one. Oh god. No, they, bur they buried Yay. them. Yay. The probably them. much more tasteful than what they, I have they, planned. Yeah. They buried them with, <laughs> with Kieran. They buried them with Kieran. <laughs> they buried them <laughs> uh, just on his own with them. 
That okay. fanatical laugh, then. That was quite scary. <laughs> yeah. I'd just like to point out that I didn't do any of the digging. If you could actually get them into a 40-foot circle, I could, <laughs> I could delete them. 40-foot circle. <laughs> He's just trying to work out what spell is that. What spell is that? What the fuck? Um, Don't tell him, because he'll make them completely resistant yeah. to, to spell. <laughs> so, it might be... See, the thing oh, is, it might be a before. waste of time in the first place if, if the city is overrun. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm down with your plan. Okay. I'll, yeah, I'll nod, I'll say. That was short thinking. Thanks. Learned from the best. You say? Well. <laughs> Yay. And then, yeah, and? like, um, <laughs> I suppose we'll let everyone else know what we're planning. Yeah. Do you know? Do. Does Lazarus insist on coming along? Clank, clank, clank. <laughs> <laughs> no. Just, let me just double check what I'm wearing. <laughs> I was going to say, I'll, yeah, I, I, I'm I'll chime wearing in. Half, right? I'll chime in and say, yeah, I'll, I'll protect from a distance. Uh, uh, it might be a good idea for you to take off your half plate then. I yeah. know. It don't give you disadvantage. It... <sighs> yeah, it does. Does it? Yeah. I know. Oh. I know it protects just... you, but we shouldn't have to yeah, fight I'll, in the I'll first place. I'll take it off. What? Hopefully we should be fine. Yeah. yeah. Where's my armor? All right. Hopefully we should be fine. So, oh, I'm on Wilhelm. Thank God for that. Are uh, we, uh, are we doing that then? Let's stop blaming Tom. Oh, fuck. Tom, you're strip. Fuck off. Oh, no, I've got breastplate, so... You've got breast is what you got. Oh, you, can always, you can always borrow my armor. Could I do that? Yeah, just because I fucking really don't want to... Well, Oh yeah, because you're both elves, so it would. It would oh, yeah. don't, we don't know he's oh. an elf. They're all you the same. But you, just... yeah, you do know I'm an elf. It's. Oh, it's we like... found out now. Well, you like I've never denied not being an elf, and like, I I do like you can tell that I am an elf. Like it's just the ears are cut off, like uh, the the tops of the ears. At one part, right? Flashback to when we're driving the the carriages. I imagine whilst Lucan was just like annoying you with questions. One of them would have been like, so what are those scars on your ears? Why have you got those? You'd have got uh, <laughs> something along the lines of, that's a tale for a different day. Oh, Just okay. A yeah, Ooh, nice. mysterious. He's suspicious. <laughs> he doesn't know. Did anyone else hear this? <laughs> uh, Chippy knows. No. Chippy knows I, what's I, going on. I don't think so, because you're on different carriages. No, Baron was on the middle one, I think, weren't you? He was, I was, yeah. I was next to Luke because I was telling him a cool story. Most of us, the only person who wasn't there was Larafi because he was like hungry on the front carriage for perception check. <laughs> I did say that I'd be in the middle somewhere. Kill people. You might be just lounging in the yeah. back of yeah, you. Know, like, the whole convoy was four carriages. Yeah, we only own one carriage. Yeah, but the, the, the merchants brought three carriages. Cool. Stop right. ruining my... Roll a one, roll a one d two to see which middle carriage you're on. <laughs> yeah. On a on a two, on a two, you were close enough. Hey, hey. <laughs> you hear what? What's a breastplate? By the way, Dom, just so I can get the uh, uh, breastplate. Go over your breast. It's just the chest armor. Yeah, what's breastplate. Base uh, base AC is is a uh, fourteen. It's medium armor and it doesn't give you a pen. Okay. Uh, I'll, just I'll just I'll just take it on the wall. You get a marker instead. Oh, wait, got no. it. You, okay. You it's on you now. Same. So just wear it <laughs> and leave your armor behind. Yeah, if I need, to, if I need to. In fact, I'll just arm up with yours. Just tell yeah, me where my hand. It's what um, it's just half plate. It's one more. Can you wear a half plate? Cause or not? Yeah, it is. Yeah, half plate still medium. Sorry. Okay. Medium. And it's fifteen, is it? Yeah, it's fifteen. It gives, me, it gives me disadvantage. Disadvantage on stealth, yeah. Okay. Okay. Make sure we try okay. back, please. Cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right. <laughs> we better get going before it's it gets dark at all. Um, we'll probably want to get them before any light goes. And so, I guess just before casting uh, the the spell, uh, I, I'm touching you and, and myself as well, my other hand, and I'm like, um, oh. just <laughs> 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 touching you, 
down there. <laughs> um, <Ooh. laughs> and I'm like, uh, just make sure you don't attack anything else. Otherwise, I don't think I can hold it. <laughs> and then, like, I do it and we just, like, pop out. Like, it's not even like a... It's just like a, a weird one a second you're there and another second you just... You pop out, but it's not a pop. It's not like a... It's not like a physical... It is a concentration. Oh, oh wait. Can, how are you doing two, then? Uh, I can do... It's uh, read at a higher levels part. A creature you... Alright. Oh, when you cast a spell, you further like you can... Tar oh, shit, that's cool. Yeah, it's cool. Um, so, yeah. And then and I guess pop, we... You pop out, set to, out towards the board, and we'll take a quick five-minute break. Cool. Quickity, I have timing as well. Also, Quickly, check Star Wars, everyone. Break.